The dialogue today is very much about talking to people, getting their ideas and suggestions and see how we can develop and grow those. We have people, young people, we have people from farming backgrounds, we have environmentalists here and they're actively engaging in a very constructive way in relation to that. I think that's very positive. This is a beginning of a new national narrative, a sense of hope that we are talking to each other and through that we will begin to unfold how we might approach a new future. We need these safe spaces to exchange points of view and different perspectives. This is a pilot and um, I think pilots by their very nature are a process by which we learn and take on board views and opinions so I would be very hopeful given what I've seen going on around the tables that there are a lot of good ideas coming up. We should hopefully try and unlock what's happening at the local level and at the policy level and bring them together so that's what I would hope it would achieve. It's really exciting to see even though it, you know this is just the first event this is the first thing we're doing how ready everyone is to do something about the environment. I think when people look back on the event I want them to think of it as people taking initiative into changing um, the future for the better. I think over the last couple of years we've seen a couple of great examples of citizen dialogue and engagement and, and how that can affect you know make real changes to policy and our constitution and all that so I think I think it's high time we did the same with climate action. What we need to do is bring it down to the level of communities and individuals right across this country. What can they do in practical terms? The intention is to have more of these dialogues across the country.